Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 17 here on Shenanigans Farm with Mr. Blue, your host with not the most. But it's alright folks. Look what I've done. I went into the GE Giants Editor for those that don't know. I'm getting pretty good at it. Somewhat. I uh, removed all the trees down through here and then I took out the bunker silo. So we have lots of room here. Lots of room. Anyway, folks, I am so terrible, so terribly sorry. How are y'all doing today? Oh, that's good. That's good. Yes, I know, Betsy. Rosie. Bubba. Oh. It's not really that dirty. Uh, but, 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 okay, I'll clean it up. I swear they're about as bad as Betsy is wanting her stuff clean. Well, folks, I hope things ain't too loud for y'all. Hope I ain't too loud. OBS is wanting a update, so I'm like, uh, okay, 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 I'll update you. So, all my settings still look pretty good, I think. So, uh, yeah. You're welcome, Bubba. Or, I mean, sorry, Rosie. Yeah, I know, I got your names confused. Uh, cows, folks. Uh, it's so, so demanding anyway we're gonna go over here to our sillage and our grass we need some sillage folks badly and some grass um, on the agenda today well y'all know this comes out there's still no poop in here yet Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I got out in the middle of the poop. No, still no poop yet. What's wrong with these girls? They're not pooping for me? Uh, 861 and 217 pigs. It's not enough to show up yet. Uh, I should be able to pick it up all. Not letting me on. But anyway, 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 we got uh, a guy up here, wood chips, quick and settle down. We're trying to get some money. We're still on the same day, that's why it's so late as we was last episode. Sorry about that. Been busy. Like I said, I was going to let y'all know something Wednesday about. Uh, 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 Senelitans, not Senelitans, Pleasant Valleys. Uh, I think I'm gonna need a little fuel in there first. I'm gonna turn it. Oh. Uh, anyway, get my mindset here. Pleasant Valley V2 has an update, it is now V3. But, folks, that's going to require a restart of the map. So I'm like, we done got, what, 16, 17 episodes in? I don't want to put too much in there. Because it's making wood chips. We just got to keep it enough to get cycled around and then I'll make fuel for its own self. So... I don't want to leave y'all cold turkey, you know, 16, 17 episode in on Pleasant Valley V2. Let's start all over on V3. It just wouldn't be fair. So, I, I got V3. Where's my trigger? Right there we go. I got the map downloaded. I got the FS17... MFS plus 
downloaded. Took a chance. Ooh, thirty-one thousand forty-six dollars. We're almost at five hundred thousand, folks. But I took a chance and went ahead, downloaded it, installed it, and I installed uh, three maps on it. But only got two of them working right now. Um, I'll tell y'all more about that later. Might do a video on it. But, uh, how much we got in here? Can I see it? Or I'm about close. Nope. 20,000? Okay. Now I have to build a little bit. Uh, where's my gauge at? Oh, need some wood put in here, folks. Um, about our sawmill over here. Where's the dig on boards for it? Oh, wait. This one don't do that. Uh, all you got right here is the wood chipper and a selling point for the logs right here. And that's all it does. And on this side, you got a selling point for the wood chips. So this one don't make planks to sell. Not here. It's over here on this one. Bunch of trees here. Which it's got pretty pretty good amount. Uh, it makes as you fuel, it makes boards and wood chips. I know this ain't realistic, but just to show y'all, if you move over here, they'll start selling. Back in some more money. Oh come on, come on. Oh man, you're almost there. But anyway, I got to show y'all something. And the, oh yeah, there's a tractor repair shop here or to buy tractors or, or, or whatever it is, is it to buy. Oh, to customize them and sell them right here. So, um, how far am I? Oh my goodness, I'm a, a long way. I'm gonna go ahead and teleport to milk sales. Because as you can see on the map right here, all the gold coins, I got them. I got them, but I didn't get the million dollars. What's up with that, huh? Well, because I didn't get all of them, I only got 99 gold coins. See, right here, found gold nuggets. I'm sorry, nuggets instead of coins. 99. I tried my best. I went all over this map, left and right, right and left, up and down, left and right, up. And, oh, wait. I couldn't find it nowhere. And I want to give a special shout out to Diesel Designs Gaming. Because I just happened to realize, wait, this is the same map that he had his troubles on. Did he ever find his? I remember watching it, but I couldn't remember if he found them all. So, went back and watched his video, and I know it's cheating, but he found all the gold nuggets. As you can see, right here, this is where you drop off your milks. And I can't... Eh. Get this way. See right here, it says milk sales down here, bakery, milk sales. Come to milk sales and come around back and you'll have your hundredth gold nugget right here. Plain open sight, folks. You have found all gold nuggets. Your remarkable find nets you one million which have been transferred to your account. So yes, we got one million four hundred and ninety nine thousand nine hundred and seventy seven dollars folks I feel like going partying but we got farming to do um having said that somebody commented on my vehicle and said uh, uh congratulations on a new field or something well I haven't quite bought that field yet folks I was just working it it's number six seven and eight well, I want number six first. 
I want number six first. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Soybeans seeded. We need it, folks. It's nothing but soybeans on it. That's going to help us out a lot. But look, it's a good thing. That's going to take half a million right there. We're going to buy Mr. Peter Wood. Mr. Wood, we'll bought you a feel. What do you think about that? <laughs> now watch him own the other ones. But anyway, folks, like I said, I do have the PB-17 uh, V3. Um, got it installed. Uh, we're going to buy this fit. And corn. All right. Corn. I forgot to check that. Chiefs are happy here. <laughs> you too. Uh, this and this corn. All right. Will we have enough? Will we have enough? 327,000. We'll have enough. They want us to fertilize it. Folks, I hate to do this, but I'm going to fertilize this field real quick. And yes, it's going to take some time. It's going to take some time. I ain't... 12 minutes in yet already doing a mission oh I have a lot of edits this one get this set up real quick oh wrong way right, right there that was pretty simple all right let's do it to it We're going to throw that pooper, pooper. All right, and as it's again, as I say, take this off, hit that, turn, hit that again, and back on. And I'm going to back off about 4.1 meters, and then we'll just sit here. Folks, today is a hot day, and as you can see up there at the top right, it's Monday, September 18th. At three o'clock, my kids be home at three thirty. So we got till then. Uh, I can't go to the start. Heck, I'm it. It's going to show y'all. So we got corn, corn, soybeans. Corey, Corey, Corey. <laughs> I don't know who Corey is, but I guess he's thinking about me or her. Could be a her, right? I don't know. Went to the doctor today, folks. That's why I haven't recorded anything today except for this. They say my cholesterol's high. No, 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 no. Don't feel sorry for me. Don't feel sorry for me. I want, I want y'all's help on. And I'm stupid for doing this. I'm stupid for doing this. Okay. For breakfast before I went to the doctor, I forgot all about going. I was going to get up, go with mom, kids, take the kids to school and stuff. And uh, mom's like, you're still going to the doctor, right? I'm like, uh, yeah. She's like, what's the matter? So I forgot. Oh. Oh, are you still going? Yeah, yeah. But I just ate like a half of a pot of meatloaf. Yes, folks. Sunday, I had, I say there was some mixed nuts. The kids ate like three quarters of the can. They didn't want the rest of it, so I had, you know, some of the nuts, mixed nuts. And uh, there was some nuts from Friday. I was like, hey, a new pig. Anyway, speed it up a little bit. There's a mixed uh, quarter of a can of cashier nuts from. Friday evening. So I had them. This was Sunday night. Sunday evening. Didn't really have a heavy supper. So I woke up Monday morning. You know, I had like a... I don't know. A, 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 
a good serving of meatloaf. You know, a, a small portion, but pretty good, pretty good portion of meatloaf. You know, I say an average person's size meatloaf. I have peace, you know. And uh, watch the Fear of the Walking Dead. Hashtag no sponsor or whatever. <laughs> anyway, that morning, I asked my daughter if she would warm up meatloaf. She warmed up the whole bowl and brought it to me. And I was hungry. And I ate it. And I ate it. And I ate it. It's my fault, okay? I should know better. I was going to the doctor. I should know better. But anyway, I get to the doctor. The doctor says your cholesterol is high and your sugar is high. I'm like, well, I just got through eating, you know. Well, you've been taking your medicine? Yes, yes, I've been taking my medicine. Which, I'm not on cholesterol medicine. I'm just, uh for sugar and high blood pressure and uh, uh nerves in my legs it's kind of pain medication for it but anyway I said yeah I took my medicine you know but probably about 6.30 this morning so she puts me on cholesterol medicine and said if my sugar ain't down next time I come in that you know I'll probably have to get on insulin or something. I'm like, well, ain't this great. But I get home. I get home now. Realize I didn't take my medicine this morning. Now, I'm an EMR, you know, so my thoughts on this, I ain't no doctor. My thoughts is maybe I don't need that cholesterol medicine. Well, uh, cause two cans of nuts. It's probably a half a can of, of nuts all together. On this, yeah, it's gonna stop on me. But it and the meatloaf. You know, I was just, I was pigging out. In other words, what do y'all think? You think I would take the cholesterol medicine? That she supposedly called in, but the drugstore says that she didn't. So I'm fighting that too. You know, I'm like, hey, what am I missing? Well, she didn't call nothing in but the pain medication. Uh, she's supposed to call in some cholesterol missing? Well, she didn't. I'm like, uh. But anyway, y'all probably don't want to hear all that anyway, but that's just my day, how it went. So, yeah. All right. 4,632. That's what I'm talking about. And now we're going to buy it. 210,582 left, folks. Now I can go in here and show you these fields. And you see right there that field 6 and field 5. I planted soybeans on field 5. 4 is corn. 7, 8 is corn. 3 is barley. And if I knew I was going to get all these fields... I would have planted two canola. Well, no, we need some barley. I forgot about it. We need some barley. But I think from now on, six and seven is going to be soybeans. Probably half soybeans, half corn, or half whatever else we need to get caught up. Now, I got enough to buy another field. I probably could buy one of these over here or something, but I don't I don't know for right now, folks. So anyway, um, I don't know how this came about. Well, I do my stupidity. Stupidity. I went in Giants Editor, but I used the wrong version of the map. Not the wrong version, I'm sorry, not the wrong version. We need to pay this back to you. Okay, that is paid back on zero. Good. All our animals are doing good. Okay. Now, 
I'm wanting to buy more sheep or more cows. I'm thinking right now probably sheep because all they need is grass and water. They'll make wool. We can sell the wool. What we get out of the wool, we'll buy cows with. Sound like a plan? What is that? Five, five million capacity? Oh my. So that's our plan, or my plan for right now. Oh crap, I was going to check some. Um, field one needs fertilized and two and three. But I'm going to have speed time up to get them fertilized. I just fertilized these, so I'll probably have to go to the next day. Uh, I might be able to get seven to this color. One, two, and three. Six and eight will be easy. It'll just be the next step, but seven, I don't know about. And I need to fertilize 32. And, of course, seven and eight is going to have to be plowed. Anyway, that's our plans, folks. That, and I'm going to show y'all what i done here. And you see where the new gravel's at? And the one floating bush that I can't get rid of. I don't know why I can't get rid of it. But yeah. So I was working on that. I took the bush line out. And you can see there is no collision no more. So I learned how to take all that out. Take this pallets, or not pallets, but boards out right here. Always took this tree and those boards out. The only thing I got left is changing this. Pretty much spreading out gravel, folks. I don't know why it does this, but some parts you have to do it. Oh man, I missed. I know y'all don't want to see this. I need to see how what's called is doing over. Ain't nobody working. But they got done left the tractor here. Jeez whiz. Alright, and as y'all noticed last time, I did take out this fence line down here. show y'all the grass is growing here we're going to have a little bit more grass so I don't know I might plow it out to the end I don't know yeah I don't know what's up with that spot of dirt there either alright now this planter Still got a lot of fertilized liquid fertilizer and fertilizer. Okay. Wow. It's got both of them. Liquid fertilizer, it's the tanks. I forgot about that. Uh don't like its baler. We're gonna sell it. Probably gonna sell this planter. I know we're selling that plow. Maybe. Might just keep it and get another one. Because we're going to have to do a lot of plowing. Uh, we're going to get an updated combine. Might lease it. And. Yeah. Alright, we got to get some trees in here. So we, this is our money maker here, I guess, folks. 
You know, I might not let this. It's been going pretty pretty good. I might just end it here. About five more minutes if I don't hit nothing. Since everything's planted and done, and I have to fast forward. But y'all got to see the last gold nugget and know where it's at. And that's a big thanks to Diesel Designs Gaming. Alright, fifteen thousand nine ninety four off of that folks. Um I want to get some extra trucks. And nothing against Kentucky Farmer, but I've been looking for some more trucks. To kind of, you know, break up the same thing all the time. So, you know, we got the Mac. And we got this guy. He does uh, the IT runner stuff, too. And we've seen him. Here's Kentucky stuff. Which ain't nothing wrong with it. I love that right there. Um, but these are some other nice trucks. This is like a city work truck, and this is just a bigger version of it that can carry, I think both of these can carry a trailer on the back uh, for like maybe a, a backhoe or a bulldozer or something on it, front loader. We got a rollback that actually works, a uh, dump truck, big dump truck, um, a T800 towing. It's for like oversized loads and stuff. Another dump truck, Volvo. Uh, another heavy haul truck. The, this black one is better than the white one to me. But the white one's actually got the oversized load signs. Um, trying to think. I done took the. I don't know what's under here or not. Oh yeah, I got the Bag Brother lifting equipment. I don't know what it attaches to. Lifting equipment with a hook with wheel loaders. Okay, I have a wheel load, loader. Um, got the John Deere one there. Oh, right there it is. Caterpillar 980K. Uh, that's a pretty nice one. Um, I'm sorry, I forgot what website I got it off of, and if I remember, I'll try to put it down below. Now, have y'all seen this on Upper Mississippi River Valley? But I'm supposed to have the one, yeah, see, I got the bigger bag ones. And this one's also got the pallets in it now. Uh, just go to FS17 mods.com, I think. I'll try to leave it in the description below. Maybe I won't forget. If I do forget, just uh, comment on the video and I'll put it in there. But pig food, cow food, you know, it's awesome, folks. Um, trying to think. What, what, oh, yeah, there's the other thing for it. Left frame. And oh yeah, we got this little guy right here. It's a pressure washer, seeds, fertilizer, fuel, all that on one trailer. And uh, I don't know if the pressure washer works because the guy that done it and didn't do it it's like he was trying to, but I never did see it in action, so. We're going to try that too, probably the next time around. And yeah, right there. So it's got it for the, uh, we can get a, yeah, terror howler. I'm trying to think what they're called. And use the bag system. And uh, I, I think that's all the stuff I got. Um, oh yeah, I want to talk to y'all about multiplayer. Um, 
Multiplayer and live streaming is what I want to talk to y'all about. So where's the plows? That's what I was going to look for. Buys a plow this time. But, um, to do a dedicated server for Farming Simulator 17, um, I done it for four slots and for all to put all my mods in there. All of my mods now. I'm going to need. I got 16.1 gigabytes of mods. So that's. Comes to 16,000 megabytes. 16,000 megabytes plus whatever the, you know, the point one is. So might well just say 17,000 megabytes is what I need. And I forgot to take a, I take pictures of everything I do pretty much. Oh, wait, I got one right here. The Plovit server ultimate with four slots for 30 days for a price of $14.30. And that's only for four slots, but it's supposed to be unlimited mod space. I don't know if that's true, uh, but it's supposed to be over 10,000 megabytes, if I got that right. So I'll need basically about $15. I don't know if there's taxes on there or not. It shouldn't be. $15 every 30 days to keep a dedicated server up. So, I guess what I'm saying is, I'm on the cultivators. No way I can't find a plow. Wait, wait. I am on the plows. Or I thought I was. All right, that and you're going to need 650 horsepower. That and I'm going to need 350. I'm getting this one where I got the chance. Buy. Yes. Okay, we got 57,000 left, so that's about all we can do. Um, sorry, folks. I'm trying to get back to the tractors. Trying to find out. See, I took a lot of my tractor mods out and tried to narrow them down. So, I still got this one to go. It's 8530. 8530. Now, I'm keeping these like that. And. All these are different in a way. So, yeah. Anybody Massey Ferguson friends? I'm not. Um, I know I don't have the money. Get it. What? Let's just do this. It'd be better to go to garage. Go to tractor that we got. And I hope, like, you know what? Oh, no, 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 no. I just want... 400 horsepower, this is 350 horsepower, so it's no problem there of this tractor pulling it. That's what I wanted to make sure of. So folks, that's pretty much all I have. Um, whatever, something else I was going to tell you about. But anyway, $15 a month. And that will get the dedicated server. You know, like I said, if I got a couple of people would donate, I will put up a dedicated server. I would like to try it first before I actually tell y'all I'm going to put one up. Because, you know, my friend Boo and J Boo, they got the game. For the PC. Okay. And. We done tried to connect. Once before. And it wouldn't let us. 
and they also have the game for Xbox One. We can't connect on Xbox One either. So we're like, well, we'll try it for PC. We can't connect PC. It says the same thing. We can go to, like, say, John Doe Farms was playing. We can go on there and join his game. Then Boo or J Boo can go in and join his game. And we can play together that way. But when I try to go their farm or they try to go my farm, we can't connect to each other. So I'm just wondering what would be cause of that. If anybody out there knows. Would it be my internet or would it be giants I need to call? That's my qu question. Who do I need to call? Because I'll be afraid, you know. Say, uh, Colin, Julian Vlogs, and J Metal 797, like, well, we want to play with you. Okay. And they send me money. I'm like, I'm sorry, I just took your money, you know, and I, I can't get the game up. I, I don't want that to happen. But, you know, I'm just throwing that talk out there. I'm not trying to get anybody to send me money, but I'm just saying, hey, if you really do want to play with me, we need to find this stuff out. And that's not going to lay down. Okay. All, right, all this stuff is done. I'm going to go wash this roller off, park it, because I don't think we need it no more. Pretty done with editing this map. Oop, washer's right here. And I just wanted to clarify that, too. I'm not a mod maker. I'm a mod editor. And I'm not good at it. Not yet. Holy cow, that's loud. Get over here. I kind of got a taste of editing mods. And I'm starting to like it. So I'm spending a little bit more time on that. But at the same time, I'm trying to push out a few extra videos. You might saw this weekend. I had four videos out. What the heck, Mr. Blue? You ain't done that in a long time. I'm almost to 10,000 views, family. And they say when I reach 10,000 views, I can get my ad revenue back. So if I get my ad revenue back and get that YouTube money rolling in, get my first YouTube check, y'all won't have to worry about uh, you know the fifteen dollars a month for servers and stuff because I have my own server up and. Uh, yeah, but how can I say that? Um, got speeches there. Ah, watch your wall, watch your wall. I was basically thinking, you know, if I do start getting YouTube money rolling in again. I'll put all that towards the game. Let's go and buy some sheep real quick. I know I got a trailer to go get them. But I'm just going to... So I got 58,000. Twenty-seven thousand two hundred for get me up to fifty sheep. There you go, folks. I bought 
Bought some more sheeps. And let's see here. Yep, 50 sheeps, and they're going to need some water and grass. So I'm going to speed the time up till the next day. And that will be the next episode. So we're going to go from there. And um, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, remember where Alaska Nugget is? Um, only reason I'm getting off, folks, my kids are home, so I want to spend some quality time with them. And uh, I'll see y'all tomorrow on Pleasant Valley. Be sure to stay tuned for it because they'll have all the upcoming updates and stuff. And also, um, yeah. Other than that, folks, that's it. So, I guess I'll see y'all tomorrow. And y'all have a, a great day. A blessed day. And I'll see y'all later. Don't run over some of these sheeps. <laughs> later, folks. Bye. Ooh, that was close.